Okay, close your eyes, everyone. Um, all right. So I want you to just kind of sit up straight, feet on the floor, okay, with your with your palms on your laps, facing upwards. Okay, it's better that you're you're seated rather than laying down because if you're laying down, you're likely to fall asleep. Okay, and I really want you to be conscious during this process because you're going to be consciously choosing your manifestations. Okay, so sitting up straight, feet on the floor, palms facing upwards in the receiving hand position. Okay, all right, so I want you to imagine that you are bringing energy from the core of the earth up the soles of your feet. Bring up this beautiful Mother, mother Earth energy up through your toes, into your um, legs, knees, thighs, up into your torso, into your heart, your chest, your lungs, across your neck, across your scalp, across your face. Relaxing your forehead, relaxing your jaw, allowing your body to completely relax. Now I want you to imagine that you're in a beautiful ball of light just above your head. You're in this ball of light. Take time to notice what color it is. And I want you to imagine yourself inside this ball of light and you're gonna feel, sense, see as this ball of light is going higher and higher. High above the body, high above the planet, higher and higher and higher. And the higher you go, the more relaxed you become. I'm gonna go past our solar system, past the Milky Way galaxy, going faster and faster and higher and higher. And again, the higher you go, the more relaxed you become. Feeling your shoulders relax, feeling your belly relax. Feeling your legs relax. As this ball of light continues traveling upwards higher and higher and higher. And it's going to go past the universe through layers and layers of light. Bright lights, dark lights, bright lights, dark lights. Keep going higher and higher and higher. You're doing great. You're going to come into a golden light. And this is the realm of the angels, archangels, ascended masters and high masters. And also the home of your soul. It's a very familiar place to you. We're going to go through this golden light and out the other side to what looks like a jelly-like substance with all the colors of the rainbow. And this is the laws of the universe, the law of assumption, the law of gestation, the law of least resistance, the law of pure potentiality, the law of compassion. And the law of compassion is this beautiful pink mist you see a window or a door, you can go through that into this beautiful, pearly, iridescent, bright, bright white light. It's bright in the sun, but it doesn't have a rise. This is the energy of God, universal intelligence, source energy, creative all that is, Allah. What do you call this energy? You're made of this substance. And I just want you to imagine this bubble of light around you dissolving until you become one with this pearly iridescent light. Breathe, let go, surrender into this divine light. You're accessing the divinity within you. God force within you. Remembering you are not separate, you're part of all that is. You are not separate, you're part of all that is. Beautiful. From this place, we can instantly change beliefs, heal traumas, download empowering beliefs, manifest our desires. It's from this place that we create all that we desire to have and to be. So in Theta Healing, we use a series of commands, not demands, commands. So creative all that is, it is commands that have this in my life now. 
And in this moment, I want you to declare either silently in your own thoughts or out loud, what are all the things that you are choosing from a field of pure potential? If it's a soulmate, let me just say soulmate. Who is this person that is going to be your life partner? Who are you choosing, desiring, calling forth? If you're wanting to improve your current relationship, what are you wanting instead of what's happening right now? If you're not happy, what do you want instead? Make that pivot. And what else? We're in the frequency of overflow plenty more than enough. Some of you spent so long focusing on what's missing. You've forgotten what you really want. And so choose. You can always make the manifestation bigger and bigger. And every time you return to this meditation, choose what's in your heart what kind of health would you like what kind of career or business clients that you would like what kind of money would you like don't just say lots of money be specific how much money each month each year in generated money passive revenue investments legacy wealth Choose, decide. Let go of the how. Don't forget to breathe. Breath brings spirit into the body. You should have a big grin on your face as you're choosing. This is a very high vibe energy. You're sending a very clear signal to the universe cohesive thoughts and emotions bring cohesive manifestations what else do you want desire what would fill you with joy bliss don't make anything wrong just choose This is divine inspiration from the creator, all that is. Letting go of the how. And just in the energy of choosing, deciding, calling in. It's the creator, all that is. It has commanded all of us in my life now in the highest and best way. Thank you. It is done, it's done, and so it is. There's these beautiful manifestations. You're gonna see them like in a bubble. And you're gonna take some of this beautiful polaridus and white light, bringing it down to the bubble that is your life. You're literally infusing this, this quantum life force energy into your bubble. And it sends out a frequency, a vibration out in the universe. And so you are now a vibrational match to your desires. It's this simple, guys, this simple. In this moment, you're finally sending out those cohesive thoughts of desire, giving birth to new manifestations from a very high frequency of love or higher. This is why this meditation works. It's not because it's a full moon or it's one, 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 because you're in the energy of love, choosing from love, not from lack, not from fear, not from doubt, but from love and faith that when you ask, it is given. I'm seeing, feeling, sensing as this bubble of light is filled with more and more of this light. And I want you to feel the feelings in your body as though it's already done. It's a done deal. Acting as if, feeling as if, 
invoke the feelings in your body. The universe responds to the currency of emotions, not words. Okay, the words help you to articulate the emotions. So feel the feelings in your body of having all of that in your life right now. Letting go of all stories, limiting beliefs, any resistance. And just be in the pure energy of just receiving, receiving and allowing. You are worthy no matter what. You don't have to wait until you're all perfect and all healed to receive. You just get to receive. What does it feel like to be in the best health and shape of your life? Your body is an amazing organism for self repair and healing. Allow your body to do what it can do for you, to heal and restore, to bring in balance and harmony. What does it feel like when your body is in balance and harmony? You're, you've got vital life force energy in every cell, molecule, atom of your body. Because your true essence is light. What does it look like and feel like when you are with your most compatible life partner, having the most amazing relationship? Feel those feelings in your body right now. Safe, loved, respected, adored, understood, passionate, nurtured, protected supported honored what else What else? Don't stop. Magnify the feelings in your body. It's sending a signal out into the universe and the universe is responding. You're exciting the particles in the quantum field. It's bringing it from the unmanifest to the manifest. Source energy is bringing it into the physical form. And the soulmate that matches that frequency is being activated. Synchronicities are being put in place so that you meet this person. If it's the improvement in the relationship, you might already be getting guidance for conversations, time together. You'll be shown the moves to make. When you're uh, doing your great work on this world, your love purpose, your mission, your career, your business, where it just flows through you, it's effortless. You love what you're doing, you're feeling fulfilled, you're feeling like you're of great value and service, you're impacting lives you've always wanted to impact. Feel those feelings in your body, that sense of fulfillment, accomplishment, that sense of pride, conviction, commitment, fortitude, grace, all of it. Feel the feelings in your body. You were doing the thing you were came here to do, do, your dharma, your life purpose, your mission, your calling. Feel the feelings. Don't forget to breathe. Has beautiful energy to flow through you. See the people that you're impacting, 
and the way that you're impacting them. Feel the gratitude and appreciation of the people that you're helping, how you've changed their lives as a result of your great work. And soon there's a bubble that is your life is filled with this beautiful pearly iridescent white light. And you grab this bubble and you place it inside your heart. And let the energy radiate through the rest of your body. You are this manifestation. It has already happened. Time is a 3D human experience. On the quantum level, it's happened already. In the holy instant, it's already yours. It's the done deal, guys, remember? And so from this moment forth, you are going to act as if it's already happened. It's already yours. And your job is just to receive, 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 accept. And over the coming days, you're going to get insights, ideas, inspiration of action steps, moves that you can make. Synchronicities will come into play where you're at the right place, the right time. The opportunity presents itself to you. No hunting, no chasing, no hustling. It comes to you, finds you because you've reached out on the quantum level. Your vibrational match and by universal law, what you focus upon grows, what you focus upon is brought to you. The manifestation comes to you. The manifesting process is the feminine. masculine component is the action, the soul-lined action. So soul-lined action might be to have that conversation with your partner to share how you feel. Or to take better care of yourself. Or to eliminate certain foods from your diet. Or choose a different exercise that feels more joyful for you. Might be to create a piece of content that speaks directly to your promised people. It might be creating a new offer. It might be to raise your prices. It might be that you have to be somewhere. You might think of a friend and you reach out. All of these are soul aligned actions as part of the receiving process. And so be fully available to, to be shown, to be guided by your soul and by the divine. And the soul aligned moves to make, to receive and accept your manifestation. And then finally, the energy of surrender, the energy of letting go. You've asked, you've manifested, you've called it in. You're acting as if, which means it's a done deal and you let it go. You're in the energy of expectation. It's coming, it's on its way. And you have complete faith and trust that it's trust that's going to show up in the highest and best way for you. Let it go of pushing, controlling, forcing. It's no longer necessary. Letting go of the struggle, letting go of the drama, the story, it just gets to be yours. You're simply choosing focusing on the desires, focusing towards your bliss, your joy, what you love, instead of what you don't. And by universal law, it must show up. And when we're in the energy of surrender, it shows up in the most perfect and sometimes unexpected way. Allow your manifestations to be easy. Be available for surprises. Be available that can show up easier and faster than your human mind can even imagine. It is done, it is done, and so it is. Mm. Okay, so I'm going to do some um, energetic downloads. So these are empowering beliefs downloaded into your subconscious mind. And in order for them to be downloaded, you just say yes. You don't have to type it into the chat. You just say like yes out loud 
and you give me permission to make this change on your behalf. So this is done via the creative all that is. Okay, so this is how we change beliefs and better healing and how it's instant and quick. Okay, so can the creative all that is, it might be God, universal intelligence, Allah, you choose the term that feels aligned for you. I'm going to use creator. Can the credible that is teach you and show you that you are lucky, that you are blessed, that everything is working out for you, that everything is working out for you in the highest and best way and in your favor. Would you like this? Thank you. So this is done in all levels, all languages, all aspects. And you may feel this coming into your body. Can the credible that is teach you and show you how to embrace uncertainty that you can drop into alignment of your soul, to surrender to the divine, to be guided, to be inspired, and to feel safe in the frequency of uncertainty, allowing life to unfold beautifully for you. Would you like this? Thank you. You guys are doing great. And can we teach you and show you that you are ready to receive your manifestations and that the manifestations can show up with ease and grace. You already know how to silence the ego to allow your manifestations to be received in gratitude and appreciation. Would you like this? Thank you. Mm -hmm. And let's release this belief. Release anywhere that you were locked into struggle, anywhere that you're struggling to prove that you're worthy, to prove that you're good enough, to prove that you're strong enough, resilient enough. And we release the need to hold on to struggle and allow your life to unfold with ease and grace. That you already know that you can figure it out. No matter what the challenge, you're completely able to figure it out that you'll be shown and guided by your soul and by the divine and the, and the perfect solution. And finally, that you know what it feels like to feel safe and walk in faith when you're moving from your comfort zone to stretch zone. So as you're walking on this edge, that you can hold the frequency of faith that even though that sometimes you get scared or uncertain, that you already know how to, what it feels like to hold the frequency vibration of faith, knowing everything is working out for you, that you'll figure it out, that everything's happening for your highest and best, allowing it to be easy, allowing it to unfold. So you can choose, decide, commit to the next level version of you. Would you like this? Thank you. Beautiful. Okay, so I'm going to bring you guys back down now. So you're going to put yourself in that bubble of light. And you're going to come back down through all the layers you went through before. So back through the, the, the J-like substance, down, down, down. Back through the bright lights, dark lights. Back through to our universe, down, down, down. Back through into our solar system back to earth and drawing that divine energy in through your crown chakra at the tip of your head and drawing that beautiful divine energy all the way down your body to your feet and again i want you to imagine like you're drawing like mother earth energy up the soles of your feet grounding you really feel connected to mother earth and pulling that mother earth energy up your body to the tip of your head feeling fully present in the now, in this moment, ready to take action, ready to receive, letting go of the how, being fully available to be shown and to be guided in the moves to make. Slowly, you can open your eyes.